Welcome everybody, live here from the 16 Mile Sports Complex, Ontario, Canada. We've got Pittsburgh Penguins Elite, the home team here in the semifinal game versus London Devilettes. I am actually broadcasting from just outside the sheet of ice here. You can see the where the benches are down over here. Well, a little bit, there's a bar in the way, but it's um, there's really nowhere for me to go because it's not high enough. So at least you'll be able to see the whole play here. I'll, Give you the pay play by play whenever it's a little out of your screen. I'm going to have to be nimble with the camera, but we'll do our best. Let's take a look at the starting lineups. Get ready, it's coming. You hunting or you running? Get ready, get ready, get ready, get ready. It's coming. Left. We got 35 seconds left in warm up. So, for those of you that have been following your, whether it's your daughter, granddaughter, niece, friend, you know, there's been some quite a few events over the last 24 hours off the ice that have happened. We've got three videos during the uh, broadcast today. We'll get you caught up on a few things. Um, you know, we got two, two during, one during the first intermission, one during the second. And I have a little clip I'll show you now from whenever. We were at Dave and Buster's as a team. So, you know, I know when you watch the girls, you see how creative they are on the ice. Um, you know, whenever they're determined sometimes to accomplish a goal, they go through all, all uh, you know, measures they, they can take to do it. So here, here's, here's how Mia Grasser found a way to get a really good score at skee-ball. So there you go, all you need is long arms, a little determination, and no security camera, and you too can get a high score at skee-ball. All right, so like I mentioned, semi-final game. Team from London, Ontario, called the Devilettes. All right, we got Breland Smith in net here for the Penguins for this to start the game, presumably the whole game. Taking the face off there is Mia Grasser, won by London, pressured by Daniels. Supported there by Stella, London skates in across the blue line. Taken away here by Grasser. Grasser finds, it's herself, sorry. And Daniels pressures at the point. London player down. Penguins take away, come away with the puck. Coming the other way here is Grasser. She's got Sweezum to her left, has it poked away. Back to the neutral zone where Pens feed it back in. That's Pegnato. Pens have to touch up to make sure they're on side. And we got our first whistle. And I didn't start my clock. Face off just outside the zone, so it was a delayed offside call. Here's Pittsburgh, enters the zone. That's Vilsek. Kiesel behind her, puck squirts out, gathered there by Litz, tries to get it over to Banizak. Down along the boards there, battle for the puck, pens throw it down into the London zone, right in front of you here, London player retrieves it. Behind the net here, forechecking a little is Kiesel. Held in at the blue line. Oh, London comes away with it though, London coming the other way. Shot towards the net goes just wide, good back check there by who was that back checking? That was Elaine Wu. Players go down here along the half wall, try to center as London. London does find the puck. 
Can't get the puck on net, though. Back out to the blue line. Held in by London. D to D. Fired towards the net. Stick down. Nice stick there by, I think that's, is that Campersall? No, that's Flitz. Number six. This puck dumped back in the Penguin zone. London there first. Penguins were changing. On the puck is Monko. Now on it is Franis. Puck on her stick is Pegnato. Tries to go cross ice pass. Does to Campersall. Campersall along the boards. Towards the net. Puck doesn't get there. Play still along the boards. Picking that puck up is Franis. Behind the net now. London tries to clear, and they do. Coming the other way, three on one is London. Back is Monko. London moves to the forehand, shot towards the net, stopped by Breland. Pins dig it out. First shot of the game belongs to London. Still in the pen zone here. Oh, Penguin player looks like tripped her up, no call. High in the pen zone here on the puck is Staub. Just outside the zone there is Campersall. Now tracked down by Grasser. She'll skate it across the center red. Campersall picks up the loose puck there. Looks, dumps it. Puck goes into the near corner. Rattles behind the net. Pref for checking is Daniels. Held in by Grasser. Daniels shields the puck. To her forehand, Grasser going to the front of the net. Daniel still shielding the puck. Good work with her body there. Joining her is Sweezum. Grasser trying to gain battle for position in front. Daniels tries this near side. Oh, has it taken away here by London. Held in though by Wu. Back down to Daniels. Backhands it to Grasser. Grasser behind the cage. Throws it towards the front. Bouncing around. Puck trickles back to the neutral zone where Wu has it. Spins to her, her, her left. Throws it off the boards. Backhanded back to center red. Neutral. Gains a blue line offside. So only 6.28 here to go in the first. Only about three and a half minutes in. No shots yet for Pittsburgh. One shot for London. Face off just outside London zone. On the draw is Banizak. To her right is Kiesel. To her left is Vilsack. That's Vilsack powering through with the puck on her forehand. Fires one towards the net. Scores. Take a look at Sydney Vilsack's rocket of a shot. Hey, Maddie. Face off one by Banizak. Wins it over to Vilsack. That was a design play. They were working on that last night. There you go, first goal of the game to the Penguins on their first shot. Shots 1-1, one, one. Penguins take advantage of theirs. Puck behind the Penguins net. Where Litz has two red jerseys on her. Puck squirts out of the battle, now London with it. Towards the net, Monko pokes it behind. Monko tries to clear it, can't. Good forecheck here, work down low I should say by London. Half wall, back to the point. Shot towards the net by London. Goes wide right. Monko gets there first, backhands it, tries to clear the zone. And does make its way to the neutral zone. London will have to touch up. They do. And they'll carry the puck in. High in the Penguin zone, loose puck. Right in front of the Penguins bench now. London, good pressure there. Monko tracks up. Monko gets tripped up. We got a hand up and a whistle blown. First penalty of the game against London. It'll be a tripping call. Penguins will go on the power play. This London team is undefeated here as well. I think they do have a tie, but no losses, so they're having a good tournament as well. Face off here in the Penguin zone. Whoops, I didn't get my clock right. I'll fix it after the power play. So that puck's cleared by London. Remember, there's no icing here on the penalty kill north of the border. Carrying the puck is Pegnato. That's one way to 
enter the zone on a power play. Just have Pegnato lug the puck. Fires one straight across the crease. Doesn't hit anything. Slap shot attempt by Marshall. Fanned on it. Staub behind the slot. Gets it down low to Franis. Franis. Second one there. She'll battle for it. Backhanded. Not back. Not hard enough on it to get it back to the point. London picks it up on the half wall. Skates it down. London killing penalty here with puck possession. Good work by London down low. Centering pass. Grasser backhands it to the Neutral zone, can't connect, but Grasser, though, takes that puck back. Enters the blue line, 2-1-2 two two with a back checker for London. Great move by Grasser, great better save by London. Let's take a look at that replay. Good work by the London netminder. Pens win the faceoff. And Penn's going to get called for an offside. Faceoff will be just outside the London zone. 4.22 to go. I'll fix my clock, like I said, after the power plays over so I don't screw up that time. Here is Stella. Gets there first. Tries to feed it up to Daniels, but hits a stick and goes out of play into the Penguins bench. They have deep benches here at this rink, and they have the um, benches themselves set back, most likely for the sled hockey stuff that happens here, which is pretty pretty popular. Face off, battle for the puck along the wall, squirts out right in front of the Devil D. They back up, so Daniels gathers the puck, enters on her backhand, forced wide, turns, looks back to the point, does find Pegnato. Pegnato towards the net, does make its way through, good stop by London goalie. Back to the point for Pittsburgh. Shot on by Sweezum. Another save by London's goalie. Back to the point, and Wu can't hold it in. It'll trickle down. She'll get there first. One London, four checker. London changing two penalty killers. 14 seconds left on the penalty. Long cross ice pass by Pegnato. Try to corral by Vilsec, but can't. Puck out in the neutral zone here. Pens just on side, barely. That was close. And now the puck goes back to the neutral zone. They'll have to touch up again. Monko backhander in the neutral zone still here, London. And penalty's over. So two shots for Pittsburgh on that power play, no goals. That's Banizak. Oh, she goes down. I don't think we're going to get a tripping call every two minutes here, so we'll have to live with the ones we get and live with the ones we don't. So Litz tries to find... Vilsec, good gap control there by London. Whacked at in the neutral zone by Pittsburgh. London throws it back to neutral. Back check, or good work there by Kiesel. And Vilsec, the goal scorer, coming away with it. Vilsec has another opportunity. Good work by London, though, to prevent that. Vilsec pressuring. Franis on the half wall, turning. Shot towards the net. Shot rebound, juicy one. Oh, couldn't be controlled there by Kiesel. Back around to that same half wall. And Freenis with that same shot towards the net again. Good stop. Oh, two good saves by the goalie there for London. Good job tracking that rebound. And they'll clear. London will change their D. Well, oh, just one D and one. No, London's changing everybody but one D. So the far side D stays on. Freenis tried to carry it in the zone. London denied that. Pittsburgh will try the other side of the ice where Camper saw first on it for Pittsburgh. Good job by Staub supporting that play along the half wall. Puck now down behind the, the net. Rolls off of Franis' stick. London skating away with it. Camper saw there again. And that'll be cleared. It's deflected, so we have no icing. Litz will get there. Two four checkers for London. A good find by Litz to find Monko. See if the Penguins can transition quickly here to keep those two London players deep. Uh, they couldn't connect on that transition pass. Good work by the London D. This is Franis. Goes weak side over to Staub. Has it taken away. Pens change a few. Devils at, Devilettes change a few. Going by Grasser. 
behind the net, Grasser, joined by another London defender who picks that puck away cleanly, tries to feed it out to her forward. Instead, Pittsburgh controls in the neutral zone, and they'll dump it back in. 42 seconds here to go in the first. Grasser still battling behind the net, tries to center it. In on Daniel's feet a little bit, couldn't get a shot, and London will clear. And that'll go down for an icing, and we'll get a whistle with 24 seconds here in the first. So in just a mere 24 seconds time, you will see the world premiere of the Stella Sweezum turkey wedding that occurred last night in the hallway. So I'm just warning you, you might want to get your tissues ready. It's a rather emotional experience. One by Penguins to the point. Shot saved there. That was a shot by um, Marshall at the point there, saved by London goalie. Battle in the corner, 12 seconds to go. Daniels back to the point. Shot again by Marshall towards the net. Rebound, still loose. Oh, we get a whistle. I think the ref might have lost sight of the puck, or is he calling something? Yeah, I'm guessing he just lost sight of the puck. It was loose in front of us, but he was on the other side. That happens. Goalie parents like that, so I won't complain. Grasser on the draw here with five seconds. Shot towards the net, never gets through. Battle in front, puck still loose. And Penn's Bury one here. Oh, just after the towel, oh, you couldn't see, sorry. Puck went in like a half a second after time expired. So no goal. All right, let's take a look at the numbers after the first. There you can see the shots. I've got one shot registered for London. About eight or nine there for Pittsburgh. One goal scored by Vilsack, assisted by Banizak. So here we go. Here's the world premiere of the Stella Sweezum wedding. From this day forward, for better, for worse, for richer, for poorer, in sickness and in health, do you, Mr. Turkey, take Stella Sweezum to be your wife? <laughs> and do you, Stella Sweezum, take the turkey to be your husband? <laughs> do you may kiss the bride? Yeah! There you go, I told you it was a tearjerker. Players switch ends here. I gotta get, I'll get my clock set up here. The next whistle. Kept in the zone by Kiesel. Puck bounces back to the goal line there. London pokes it to the corner to keep it out of danger. A lot of jerseys there. Back to the point, it looks like is Litz. Litz tries to shoot. Get puck towards the net. Good stick by London. Whoops. I'm trying to zoom in a little so we can see this a little better. Puck behind the cage here. London has it. Still on the half wall. And trickles down now in front of Breland. Centering to Kiesel. Kiesel, behind the net here is Ignato. Ignato chipping it around. Now back in front of us is Pegnato. Pegnato, good skating by Layla. Still with the puck is Layla. Layla still with it, shoots one just wide. Into the corner. And cleared. Corralled quickly, though, by Pittsburgh. That's Litz, who dumps it right back in. 
Penguins will change one player, two players. The D change for Pittsburgh. Monko on, Wu on. Wu keeps it in with a skate. London, up the half wall there. Centering attempt. Goalie prevents that from happening. Pittsburgh behind the net, that's Staub still. And London skating with it. And taken away again. Pittsburgh, good job. Clogging up the neutral zone there, getting the puck and entering the zone. That's Campersall. Campersall driving wide to her left, shoots one towards the net, and that's stopped. So 7.39 to go here in the second. One shot registered in the second for Pittsburgh. And that's Grasser, takes the face off. Puck dumps back down into the Penguin zone here. Where Breland will freeze it. Face off to the right of Breland. Shot, doesn't get through. London, backhands towards the net. Good save by Breland. Here's Wu. Clears it. Wu again. Three, three red jerseys there. Pittsburgh couldn't find the weak side of the ice. London forces a turnover. D to D pass. And good job again in the neutral zone. That's Grasser. Grasser, back to Sweezum. Sweezum, shot wide left. In the corner. Daniels hands it off to Grasser. Back to Daniels. Daniels behind the cage. Tries to center. Puck loose behind the cage. Daniels tries to center again. Now it's loose high in the slot. Pinching down is Wu. Over to Daniels in the corner. And then cleared by London. Goes the whole way down. No icing. And picked up here by Monko. Monko looks up. Good pass by Monko. London changing. Can Penguins catch him in a bad change? That's Grasser. Makes a move to her backhand. Forehand. Shoots one. Mm, I don't think they got on net. London got back just in time and converged on her. Prevented her from getting a clean shot. And we got a whistle. That's off. Zoom in a little bit for you. So who's out there for Pittsburgh now? I got Marshall and Pegnato on D. I've got Vilsek, Banizak, and Kiesel. Your forwards. Vilsek centers it. Banizak would stick by London. Prevents that shot there by uh, Kiesel, I believe, was in front of the net. London. Across the blue line. And then shoots one, just wide, short side. Behind the net here is Marshall. And Marshall, still with it, kicks it back up to her skate, or to her stick. Marshall trying to drive wide. Good work there by London. the point there. Shot towards the net. Goes just wide. That was Wu with that shot, I think. No, it wasn't. It was Marshall with that shot. And this puck will go the whole way down for icing, so I'm just going to leave the camera where it is. And the whistle. 5-12 to go in the second. Score one nothing Pittsburgh. Franis takes the face off. Centering attempt. Goes to the net. Tracked down and covered by London's goalie. Shot registered for Pittsburgh. In that count, I have 11 for Pittsburgh and 3 for London. Back on the far corner here now. Held in by Wu. Wu. 
Oh, London tracked that down or blocked that shot. Penguins gather in the neutral zone, try to send it in. Cut off there by London. And they'll clear it this time, though. Litz tries to go weak side. Puck will meander its way down behind the goal line there. Well, Campersall pins it along the boards. Franis helps her out. Try to center. That was uh, Staub's stick tied up. Behind the net, chasing it is Franis. And cleared by London. Uh-oh, London. Here comes London on a breakaway. And I don't know if she got the shot off or not. I think she might have, so I'll give her. I was trying to track it in my... Here comes this shot towards the net, blocked. Let's... And Campersol. Shot off the side of the cage. Shot out. Cleared attempt by Wu. Held in by London. Franis. Good pressure at Pittsburgh at the point. And there comes Campersol. She gets tripped up. Another penalty coming up on London here. And they touch up. We'll have a whistle. Those tripping penalties and open ice are hard not to call. Pittsburgh goes on their second power play of the game. We've got two-minute penalties here. That's another thing that uh, deviates from USA Hockey. Whenever you play 10-minute periods in USA Hockey rules, that's actually only a one-minute penalty. And I think if your penalty periods are 12 minutes or longer, they're a minute and a half, and then if they're 15 minutes or longer, I think, then they're two minutes. Shot out by Grasser. I'll zoom in a little here. So on this power play, you got Daniels, who centers it to Grasser to squeeze him. Towards the net, and they scored. I had the camera just off. Let's see what we can see here. I think it was Daniels who put it in. Assisted by Sweezum and Grasser, I believe. So penalty's over. I'll have to fix that on my clock. Sorry, I got a lot of things going on here. Remove that and start the clock. Okay, what do we got? 3.15 to go. We got a whistle offside call. There, I think I'm good now. That will squeeze him on the draw. Run it back to Monko. The Hegnato there. And tracked down by Grasser. Grasser has got three red jerseys on her. Has that puck poked to the corner. She'll get there and center it. Nobody home for Pittsburgh. And that puck's cleared by London. Where Pegnato will gather it off the wall. So two penalties called on London, none on Pittsburgh. you got to figure... Refs are going to be looking for an opportunity to get London a one-man advantage here soon. London carries it in. Shot towards the net. Saved by Breland. And Banizak in the neutral zone. This is Vilsack. Up to Banizak. Still second front, finds its way to the point. This is Marshall at the point, shoots one. And makes its way through and covered up and whistle blown. 156 to go here in the second period. Scored Pittsburgh two, London zero. Shots 13 to five. And this is London, tries to clear and whistle. Oh, no, that's the whistle on the other rink, sorry. There's four rinks here, or four sheets here at this rink, I should say. Behind the London net now into the corner. It's Marshall battling at the blue line, goes back to Banizak. Banizak, who covered for Marshall, 
try to get it up ice in front of the benches here. They'll battle for the puck. Wu goes weak side. Nice pass by Wu over to Marshall. London for checking nicely here, preventing Pittsburgh from transitioning. Nice pass there. to the far corner. Just one minute here to go in the second. It's Wu holding it in at the point. And a whistle. And we got a tripping call coming up. Against Staub. So there's your penalty on Pittsburgh. You had to have known that one was coming soon. Not to say it wasn't valid, but you just had to know it was coming. So unless London scores here, it'll be a carryover penalty and carry over into the third. Face off. Play in the Pittsburgh zone where Pegnato clears. Remember, no icing here on the penalty kill, so that's a legal play. London will gather a good forecheck there by Franis. And now that's Pegnato and Wu. Collision there at the blue line. Wu has it. A good move by Wu. Back to her forehand. Shoots one. Goes far. Just misses far. Side. There's London carrying it across the Penguins blue line. Ten seconds to go here in this period. Shot towards the net. Sticked at by Pittsburgh. Goes behind the cage. London on the half wall. Turning. Lou, cl Wu clogging it up. Pegnato tracking it down. One second to go, and she'll just send it, and that'll do it for the second. So, score after two. Pittsburgh, two. London, zero. Shots, 13 to five. Pittsburgh. So I promised you three videos. The first video was the ski ball technique. The second one was Stella's wedding, and this one some of you might have seen. But, and this was not planted, I promise. But a couple of the families were at the beach, at the lake shore. And one of the girls looked down in between a large crevice, which you'll see, and spotted something. This is called the Resurrection of Mila, which was the name of this animal that they found. Stuffed animal, to be clear. No animals were harmed in the filming of this video. So look at that. Finding a penguin. And they, they assured me that that wasn't a setup. Finding a penguin in between gigantic rocks at the lakeshore is a good omen for this weekend. Penguins start the third period. That's Monko. And the reason why they call it Mila, it has a tag on it. And it says Mila on it. So it's Mila the penguin. It's now a major award. It's been given to a girl after every game. Not exactly sure what it's given for. Maybe it's for uh, making... Good plays in tight places. So London on the power play here. 43 seconds to go on this power play as we start the third period. Penn's trying to kill the power play here by zone time in London zone. It's a good way to do it. Pegnato's the one harassing the London players right now. Shot at by Grasser. And along the half wall, London tries to the, tries the weak side of the ice this time. A little bit of room over there, but good skating by Grasser. Clogs it up. Flips it back in London zone. They'll try that far side this time again. 
Good work by penguins here in the neutral zone. And Grasser will send it down. It's going to rattle around over here, so I'll just leave the camera right there. London skating. And that's Pegnato still. Staub changing. Or not changing, coming out of the box. And Banazak on for her. Penguins 5 on 5. Another penalty, or the first penalty against Pittsburgh killed successfully. Coming in the Penguin zone is London. Backing up on D there is Monko. I think that's Banazak who came down to help. No, that was Vilsek who did. Held at the blue line by London and good skating there by Monko. Chips it down behind the Devilettes defender. She'll go in after it herself. Covering for her is Banazak back at the point. London digs it out. That's Litz. Surveys. Off of the skate. Dumped down in anyway by Banizak. Two four checkers for Pittsburgh. Quick movement of the puck. Out to the point. Shot by Pittsburgh. Saved. And we're going the other way a little bit. Battle on the boards. Comes down here deep into London zone. Your four checkers are Kiesel, which is first, and there's Banazak, which is second. Banazak centers it. Nobody home there. Far wall. London has a little space. Back on D is Litz. Penguins again force a turnover in the neutral zone. It's been a theme of this game. Penguins doing a good job getting that puck quickly in the neutral zone, preventing London from generating any rushes. London, though, is doing a good job of in general, clearing the zone pretty quickly. You don't see Penguins with too many, like, 30 or 45 second shifts with possession in the London zone. So, a lot of neutral zone play here in this game. And Franis tries to clear, held in. Right in front of the net is Wu. Skates it to the wall. And this is uh, Litz, who's going to send it Pull way down the ice for an icing and whistle. 8.31 here in the third. Score is still 2 0 Pittsburgh. Shots 14 to 5. I'm going to zoom in a little bit for you. Whoops, not that much. I do have to fix my zoom sensitivity. We can use it a little bit better then. Puck in play. Squeeze him. Now Daniels. Can't see that along the boards. And Daniels again. Again, I've got a little partition here, so you can't see what's happening right there. Pretty rude of your daughters or nieces to be playing in a spot you can't see. I'll let them know after the game. Pegnato pressures. Daniels there too. London behind the cage now. Yellow jersey's not giving him any time or space. And puck squirts back to the neutral zone. London sends it back in. Delayed offside call. We'll have to touch up. Here's Marshall skating with it. Marshall sends it down behind the net. Here's London. Oh, good work there by Grasser. Oh, can't come away with it. And London clears. Marshall forces her wide. Centering attempt. Good save by Breland. Two saves there by Breland. Good opportunity by London. Shut down by Breland. Face off one by London. 
Shot. Never get through. Never got through. Litz behind the cage. London coming on strong here the last couple minutes. Pittsburgh, a lot of time in their own zone. There's Banizak. And sent down the ice partially. Or London will corral it. Try to transition back into the Penguin zone here again. Penguins with good pressure in the neutral zone prevents a clean entry. But an entry nonetheless, as London has it in the corner. A good move along the goal line there. Shot towards the net. Saved by Breland. And a whistle. Freeland, not much action early, but the last couple of minutes had to make about three or four saves. She's been up for the task. Good job by her staying engaged in the game here with sometimes with some lulls. So we got here a Pittsburgh penalty. Who's that on? Uh, Kiesel. Didn't see that call. Sorry. Not sure what it was. So, Penguins will go on the penalty kill. That's Campersall. Cleared by Pittsburgh. Sorry, I'm putting in the penalty in the thing. Just give me one second. There we go. High in the zone here is London. Campersall there. Puck loose. Back that by Grasser. In front of the net here is Monko. Monko backhands it, clears it. Here's Campersall. Gets a stick on it. Pops it up here in the neutral zone. Pittsburgh, that's Wu, who finds Monko. Shoots one towards the net. Saved there by London's goalie. Good penalty killing by Pittsburgh. Play right in front of the open door of the London bench. Trickles down here into the corner for Pittsburgh where Wu evades the four checker to her forehand up the half wall. Good job by Elaine Wu. Daniels cut off there. Pegnato. The Daniels. Daniels flips it down into deep into the London zone here. Pressuring behind the net is Banizak. Penalties over. Penguins kill two penalties. Play here right in front of you in the near corner where Daniels pins her against the boards, but Puck does find a London stick. Weak side pass. And Daniels has it in the neutral zone. Daniels tries to find Grasser. London surveys. Cut off nicely by Vilsek. Vilsek makes a move at the blue line. Makes another move. Vilsek still with it. Here's London. Chipping it in. Marshall there. 340 to go here in the third. Pittsburgh 2, London 0. Marshall again behind the cage. Posting up in front is Pegnato. Ampersol is joining there in the corner, centering pass. Pegnato knocks that wide. Back into the corner, centering attempt again, right again by Pegnato. Pegnato, puck whacked at, held in here. Shot towards the net. Breland steers that aside. In the far corner or in the far wall now, where clearing attempt by Vilsek held in by London. Battle high in the zone here. Campersall with it. Turns. Off the boards. Puck still hung up until Vilsek digs it out. Vilsek skates it. Across the red line. 
and we'll try to get it deep and change. She gets it deep enough for the change, so Penguins will get a full change. London skating. Finds a little open ice on the near far side. London shoots one towards the net off of a skate. I don't think that shot ever got through. That was uh, Pegnato's skate. Here's London. London really stretching the ice here as far as laterally. Those D to D passes or cross ice passes, so they're having a little success that way. But if Pens can pick that off, boy, that'll create an opportunity coming the other way. Here's Pittsburgh now. There's Stella. Stella carries it in the zone, has Campersol behind her. Back down in the corner to Stella. Shot towards the net. Franis. And icing hand up. Wasn't sure if it would have hit the Penguin player at the point. It didn't. We get an icing call. Oh, so whenever I said Pittsburgh was on the kill, I missed that they were offsetting penalties. I didn't realize there was a uh, a London penalty, too. So there was no power play. It was coincidental, so it was 5-on-5 five five hockey. I didn't see them both going. I think we got a timeout here with 150 to go. Oh, now it's catching the net. So we've got an offensive zone face-off here for Pittsburgh. On the ice for Pittsburgh is Pagnotto, Banizak, Grasser, Wu, and Marshall. Banizak lined up to take the face-off. Pagnotto up in a forward position, normally you see her back in a defensive position. Face off, one by Pittsburgh, back to the point. It's Marshall, Marshall on her backhand, tries to turn it to her forehand, evades the four checker, or pressure I should say, not four checker. Good work there by Marshall not to turn that puck over at the blue line. That would have been an odd man break the other way. Penguins, gonna try to kill this last minute 30 of this game here in the Devil's Devilette zone. That'd be the best way to do this. Banizak makes a nice move. Let's try to clear. Held in again by Marshall, time being, and now puck back into the Devilette zone. Pens touch up. There's Wu. He's going to skate around the net behind Breland. Wu tries to get it up to Marshall. So no goalie here for Devilettes. They pulled their goalie, so six on five. Although they only have five players out there. So it's five on five, even though they pulled their goalie. There we go. Now they put the sixth player out there. And that sixth player fresh off the bench keeps that puck in the zone. And puck cleared by Pittsburgh. It's Banizak entering the zone. Here's Devilettes towards the net. Breland. Wraparound attempt, and I think she got a save there. And that puck sent down by Pittsburgh, no ice. 10 seconds to go here. Vilsec, two, one. There's your horn, and there's your game. Final score, Pittsburgh 2, Devilettes nothing. Pittsburgh will play in the championship game here at, I believe, 1 o'clock. Same rink. We will go and 
check out of our hotel, get something to eat. See you back here. We will live stream the finals. Thanks for joining us again, 1 o'clock, for those of you that can make it, and uh, we'll see you then.